wanted to address this because I think it's a great question and there were some other good comments of suggestions in that last video that I made but basically this question is what if you're telling people you don't want guests and they're still getting them for you anyway so of course the first thing is always just being gracious and just telling them thank you because you know it's taken their time energy money and they thought about you so just saying thank you now another thing to think about is why people might be giving you gifts so for some people their love language is gifts they love getting them and they enjoy giving them as well so that could be one reason why people continue to want to give you gifts another reason could be that some people do get a little bit of a rush from shopping and that's a little bit more about them that they enjoy that rush and now they can just give that item to somebody else and not have to bring it into their own home now, when I'm working with clients and they're working on decluttering, I let them make me the bad guy and I tell them, you could just tell family and friends that you're working with a professional organizer and that I have told them they really shouldn't bring more things in right now while they're decluttering and working on balance in their home. So you can always tell people that you're following a professional organizer. And then another thing to think about is people don't know what they don't know. So you do need to communicate I am working on not bringing more things in, but here are some things that we would love to have. It might be that you just want their time, and so you would love to go on an outing, go hiking, go out to dinner, go out for drinks, whatever it is you enjoy doing. It could be that you would love them to make meals for your family so you get a break from cooking. It might be that they pay for activities for your children, swim lessons, sporting fees, whatever your kids are into, or something for your family that you can enjoy throughout the year, like a membership to the zoo, children's museum, theater tickets, whatever it is that you enjoy. Now, I would like to think that people will take all that into consideration because if they're giving a gift, hopefully they're giving something that they know that you would rather have. And if they're not listening to that, then it might be a little bit more about them. So if you just can't get people to stop giving you gifts, you can't control them. So then just accept the gift, say thank you, text them a photo of your family using it or displaying it, and then on your own time, just let it go and get it out of your house. So I hope that helps and I hope you have a great day.